So well my friends, here we go again. Next court in the line, you will see it. But you see I have still the same on because it is the same day. Because the next court is not that far away from that area. So I make this on one day. Because you know why? <laughs> Long routes. And when it is in the near of course. And now great view from here, watch this. You see that? That looks amazing or? Then you know where we are. Last time, you know, the swim court where I told you the city and the other direction that it was completely there. Complete by those mountains there on there we were the last time. And now we have to drive a little bit this. And where I had to quit that was on the last mountains where you will not see from here, you know. <laughs> there you know the routes. And now let's enter in. Complete the other court again. Street. Yeah, and not that far away a little bit now, and then we see us. Well, now on the way it gets really cold, you know, windy, really, really fresh. Watch this. So really cold wind, you know, also when I, when I uh, breathed, I saw the brief, you know. But now watch, nice view from here. Here we are in the next village. And you see, those are the mountains. And here we have a tennis club. And now we have to drive a little bit more. Yeah, and then we are on the court. So only a few meters from the last side, but I want to show you the tennis court because it's very beautiful for my tennis players in the videos. Now watch, very nice, or? And here are also, you know, you don't see them from the woods. But here with restaurant to sit, you know, that is really, really nice. Yeah, and uh, under is the football field, you see that? And yeah, here, it's really cool to play, but here I have never played tennis, you know. I was in almost all other areas, but Götzens, hmm, I don't know, maybe we have played here a tournament, but I don't think so, you know. Yeah, but really nice. But now, street ball. So, and another sports place, but there I was never in, but it looks really cool. Watch now. That is a very big building, you see, that is very high. You don't see it in there. And here, on the whole building, there is parking area, you know. You see that? That is all parking area to the uh, view to the mountains. And all those parking area is all the indoor hall, you know where we are. Then you know how big this hall is, you see that? That is really nice with that view. And you see, under us there is an indoor hall, but I have not told you what is in there. But there I was never in. I don't know how it looks, I cannot tell you. But that I will check out in the internet. But here you see, very nice view. And here you see the football field. You see that? The tennis where we stand. Great view. Now the wine, sorry I have no form. But this place under us, there is a sports place, you know, an indoor hall. But I cannot tell you if it is for winter or for summer. You know what they have now in it. I will show you what it is. Really great. But you can now think football. Handball, uh, calisthenics, no, nothing of that. It is something what I like, what I do in summer and what I had done back in the days in winter but never in a club. Maybe you see it now. It is hockey. Hockey is it, you know. So in there they have to play hockey. But I don't know if they now have ice in there, but I don't think so. Maybe, maybe not, but I, I don't think so. In winter maybe, but maybe they train now in summer hockey or... Yeah, but that is... Yeah. Great, I will check this out, you know. That is a place where I never was in, so I cannot tell you that. And here we have the cows on there, you see them? So we have a lot of sports here, you know, for everything is here something. And now I have to drive. Wow, well, now I've checked it out. Yeah, really, that is an, an hockey. You have to show you a picture. Wow, that looks really amazing. Or 
in a village or hot caving, you know. But there I never was really crazy, you know. Because in that village there is no basketball, so I'm not often here. But oh, you know hockey I played in my village there we had a small place in winter, you have seen my video. And I was also in the indoor hall at my city, but in a village and own hockey for winter war. Wow, that costs also or great great great. So my friends, not far away, but nice view. Watch. That is nice or what a panorama here. And now only a few minutes and then we have arrived. And then we have this day. That is the second last day on that side of the area. But the last day then on from my city, this side, you know, that is on those mountains, the last one on there. And then we have to drive all warm behind those mountains, you know. That is then a long road. But now we enter in and here we have another tennis court there. Tennis courts are all everywhere here, you know. So when I want to film tennis courts, but then I need a year, I tell you that. <laughs> so let's get to the place. <laughs> so it now starts to rain, but I drove now a other route, which I normally don't take, you know, through the houses in small streets. And there out of nowhere, there comes a basketball court, you know, but a private one. It is, I think, kindergarten. Watch this, but it looks so nice. And here is the ring. You see it there on those uh, wooden thing, there hangs the ring. But boy, when you are a kid, that would be a dream place, you know, to play there. But no goal, only the grass and the basketball ring. Wow, that I wanted to show you. First time that I see it. So now the echo was out, but watch the weather, it starts to rain. Here it is blue, but here I hope I get not wet, you know, because I have only this and always the white band. Why this? Because then the cars see me better, you know, I have no light. And I always have to wear something where the cars see me, you know. <laughs> and yeah, but we will see. Now we go there. So almost arrived, but very fresh, you know. I have my gloves. But here we enter in now, you know. Now here we are. It's not far away. And you see here the view again. And how the weather can be different, you know. Completely in there, you see it, lo it looks like raining. And now on that side where we were the last time here it is now the blue sky and here it looks really bad and it goes so quick in the mountains you know and for example the swim court was completely on the last thing almost you know <laughs> and here in this mountain on there is the hidden court and here in the mountain, in there, on the mountain, there is the VIB Ridge Court. And now we have to go this way, you know. Then you will know all areas in my federal state, but that is only a small piece, you know. But with bicycle, always long routes. And yeah, that it is. And now we drive in. So, almost here, we are in the village. But watch now. The weather here gets better and that view. From here we came now, that street upwards. And now we have to drive upwards, you know. <laughs> These are the routes, you know. And my city is in there, you know. Around this point, there is the city, yeah. And here it gets beautiful. So, but now we have to enter in. And to mention you the name of the court, a little bit sweating, you know. From here we came, you have seen it, all upwards now. The court is called the last hole court, you know. And here you see best why now, all upwards, you see it is steep, you know. And from here, because we are in the last hole, you know. You see here is shadow, there is a river, and there is nothing anymore, you know. The last hole, the last place to go, you know. That is why it's called the last hole place. And yeah, it's not the easiest one. It's not that far away, but it is not that easy, you know, you have to be fit. And now we enter in, in the last hole court. So, and to the last meters, I drive with the bicycle that you see me, you know. Wait, wow, that is so steep that I have to... Wait, 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 wow, now we have it. So, and you see me 
how to reach those courts, you know. <laughs> but here, there it goes to the other mountains in, you know, and then one and a half hour and then we would be at Watergate Court, you know, the second highest at 1370, but now we arrive, but you see, these are routes where you have to drive upwards, upwards, you see, there, yeah, here you see the, for the fushing, for, I don't know in English, I, you have to sweat to reach courts, you know, but no problem. So here we are, you see, football field, and on the last edge of this village, there we have it, you know, but be prepared, you know, on a bicycle to reach those things is not easy. No, but here it is really fresh, you know. So, but here it is close. No, what is this? Why is it closed? Tell me that. Here we have the basketball ring, you see. I, I, You see it? The last hole caught. Wow, wait. Wow. So, we have arrived, but the thing is down. I, that is always in the villages, you know. You never know when it's open or not. They are also, when they say it is open, and, but when they see there is no one, weather is bad, and they close it. But the thing is, if we should play one ball now, yeah. Ay, ay, ay. But yeah, it is what it is. We are here and we have to play a ball, yeah. Ay, ay, ay. So. Ay, ay, ay. That is always the thing, you know. Because people try to bark and whatever, and so they close it, but, you know. <laughs> now we check it out, and we see, that you see the court, you know, the last whole court, you know, because here, in that village is nothing anymore, and to reach it is really the last hole, and here we have it. Basketball court. So, there we go. Wait, wait, wait. So, now my friends, we enter in, in the door, and here we are. So, that is the place that you see it. The streetball court. The last hole court, you know. But the last hole you can also take as another meaning because the roughest asphalt, you see those are those sharp stones and you see how it looks, these are the old uh, bands, banden, net and here we have the ring but here it goes outside, you know, here you have a hole there was a goal, you know, but now and also on the other side, and the ball can fall outwards, you know. And there, the last hole, you know. <laughs> but I mean the last hole because it is on the last thing. And when the ball falls over there, then you have to run to the football field, you know. So don't bring a high jumping ball here. So a Raybro crossover or a My Toys rubber ball is not the best solution. And here, the same, you know, and here it can also fall outwards. Yeah, but really, really rough asphalt, you know. That, I tell you that, that is more rough on almost any street where cars are driving, <laughs> you know. <laughs> but it is what it is. And here, the last hole. And as many courts in the villages, a little bit more outside, you always have light, you know. That is also a part which they did in the 90s 
they build all with light at night, you know. I don't know if they took in winter the the ice uh, ice stock schießen, you know, the sport, not curling, the other one. In my village that was always at night, but now we play, you know. So, nice. Won't you let me dream That you might again For just one day So let my blue heart pretend I'm just a fool And I can't get over you So let me dream If my dreams can come true I know you remember what we used to have You wanna throw that all away How it makes me feel so sad Won't you let me dream Oh, what else can I do Won't you let me dream If my dreams can't come true You know, but this area I like, you know, when you are here, that is really comfortable. Also when it is the last hole, and maybe I've seen it is not the best place, you know. There is no net, there is rough asphalt, the ball can fall out. You know, the asphalt is really brutal as uh, aggressive because there are also stones in there, yeah. Bigger ones, smaller ones, and you see those sharp edges. This is really, really brutal, you know. That is a stone asphalt, that is not a normal asphalt. This is, so maybe the roughest, you know, a hidden court is also a bit. And you see, the indoor ball can take a bunch. Yeah, here is now a little scratch. I mean, it's not the best solution to play an indoor ball on such a court, you know. Better on rubber, but you see, some indoor balls get scratched immediately, but this ball can really take a bunch, but don't do it, you know. If you use it outdoors on a good rubber place or really smooth asphalt. But now here, you know, on the last hole, I mean, when you stay here, you know, from here the view to the other side of the mountain, that is really uh, mind-blowing and relaxing, I tell you that. Even if you know here we are at the last hole, the last place, there is no one, you know. Only 
people with dogs are here or to walk from that village other people will never come here you know i tell you that from my area and my city if you have no friends here or nothing to do you will never ever come in your life here you know and there it is but it's really the last hole but yeah i like it here you know that has good vibes and yeah when you live here you are happy to have such a court you know but for example what would be the best ball on such a court now when we discussed this ball you know to the boys back we made all ball tests which balls would be perfect here what ball would you bring here on such a court you know when you see also the uh, the edge of the board and that is i think why we got this scratch in you see that because i hit it sometimes there there you always have to be careful i tell you this also when you have the best place here but a board which is very sharp or very thin and the ball goes there then you also have a problem you know here the edges are round that is not a problem yeah but when it falls outwards you know there are also stones yeah but other side is a little bit rougher and here you see it's really nice but what ball would you bring here and play in there here we have such a duel you know i don't know what was there 20 30 years ago there was not here but here you see it's more rougher when it falls outwards here this is more stones yeah you see so is it a rubber ball or would you bring in a composite indoor outdoor ball so and if, how many balls have you to choose one two balls so my opinion is if you live here and you could never leave this place which ball would you bring in here my choice would be one of the uh, composite indoor outdoor balls in the low budget you know low budget balls for example the wilson ncaa replica game ball around 40 euro the ball can take a bunch if it gets destroyed it hurts not that much but for one season here that should reach you know or the mr mike ball also in solution 35 euro around these are balls which i have in my mind now or you bring in a rubber ball the doe doe pro the echo but from the feeling i would take and wilson or the mr mike ball there you have really for one season a great choice and if you have the chance for two balls then i would do the same buy the wilson ncaa replica or the mr mike ball for examples they are always a recommendation and then you buy a DRV or a DRV Pro the Echo or a Nike Playground, such a ball. When it is really bad weather, wet, then you bring in the rubber ball and on better days in summer more, the composite. Well, that would be the best option. Then you have to spend around 60 euro for both balls, 65, 70, you know. And that for one season is the perfect choice in my opinion, you know. Yeah, and now we play on, the sun comes out, you know. I thought you was a nature. You flew away just like a bird. I thought you was a nature. You flew away just like a bird. So, ta -da, I saved it. It didn't fall to the football field. <laughs> My pants is wet, you know. Don't wonder, that is from the bicycling. When you arrive, you are wet always. But I have to wear the white thing because that people see me on the bicycle, you know. I have no light and you see here, the mountains, it gets quick dark, you know. We have it now around yeah two o'clock afternoon and here it is really shadow you know so i always have to be careful yeah from high to low you know listen i always make this you know always see but when you go i don't know a little bit you know, 
So, Ding Dong, Ding Dong, Ding Dong. There are no bells, no. My Ding Dong. I have a wish what you should do when you are younger. Really dry this out. What do you see here? Here, what do you hear? What do you see? You hear only the nature. And now, put away your smartphone, put away your headphones, all what is electronic. Huh? Put it away, you know. So many people nowadays don't do that anymore. They are on a sports place, smartphone beside, with the ear, uh, with the headphones, I don't know how it's called. Earphones, headphones, you know, or the big ones. Watching on the smartphone, when they drive on a bicycle, the app on, navigation, you know, put away all. Now, watch this. No smartphone here, I don't need it. Nothing electronic here, I don't need it. I don't watch to my smartphone, I don't need it now. I'm completely here, right now, live, completely, you know? 100% I live this moment. How many people do this nowadays? Almost no one. And now watch. Relax time. Relax, 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 relax. Only here the nature, relax. Be by yourself, you know? Relax, relax. When you go the next time to a court, put all away for the whole session. The way to the court, on the court, and the way back home. You know, be by yourself, live in the moment. That is so important. Believe me that. Also by concerts, the people nowadays only film, smartphone, everything, watch to the display. No one enjoys the moment, right now, right here, live. You know, and when you are here, watch to those things, you know, to those mountains. Other people, they would pay money if they could see such a panorama, you know. Enjoy that what you have. Doesn't matter where you are, on the sea, in a city, on the beach, in the mountains, in cold, in warm areas. Enjoy the moment, you know. Like back in the days, there was no thing. No electronic. People smiled, they talked with each other, they had a nice time. And try this one time out, that is really beautiful. And you will see that when you're not used to that, that will be difficult because, oh, is Instagram something? Oh, TikTok, oh, I have to watch someone. I had heard my, tele my smartphone, someone has uh, messaged me something. No, away doesn't interest you. You only dare and play, nothing else. That is forgotten, what people have really forgotten. Enjoy the moment. And now, I play this side, you know. Fresh air. Oh, nice. I tell you that. So, and now this side, you know. But here I have to be a little bit more careful. Because when the ball falls out here, you know, then there it is not the best solution. But here is a net, you know, that is fixed. Yeah. But still, when it goes out there, yeah, it does not roll that much, but always be careful. And now, let's get it on.
by using that wall. That was now great. I have grabbed it. On asphalt would be bad. Wow, nice. So my friends, now I'm finished. We finished the session. Now you have seen the last hole caught. You know, a nice place. Absolutely not the best for to play, but to relax and enjoy it, then it is really nice here, you know. Yeah, and that it is. And from that area, I say goodbye. Enjoy your playing next time. And to the ball, you see, there is nothing, only this scratch, but that was from the board, I think. All other. So you see, the ball can really take a bunch. Indoor ball, but yeah, don't do it outdoor, better indoor. So from that, we see us next time. Until then, bye and ciao.